So I've never really liked my smile. Um, I, oftentimes people tell me, you should be confident in your smile, you should like your smile, it's a great smile compared to other people. And I'm like, yeah, but I'm not happy with it. And the thing I'm trying to get at is, um, your smile is something that's so important because your smile is what makes you you. I'm Dr. Rich Creaseman. I've been doing smile makeovers like this for 25 years here in the Buckhead area. And in that span, I've literally done thousands and thousands of cases, very much, many of them very much like bows. I don't like taking pictures or anything unless the camera's far away. And if it's close, I smile with my mouth closed. If you go to all, all my social media, uh, my mouth is closed unless the camera's far away. Or when I'm laughing, you see me laughing like this. It's just, it, it's something that I've always done. So Bo came to me and said he wanted to sit down and discuss his smile. He said that though his smile wasn't really bad, he never was really confident in it. He always had found that he guarded himself when he, when he smiled and he actually showed me some pictures of his social media where up close you couldn't really see his teeth but in like far away photos you could you know he'd give that broader smile so obviously he was self-conscious about the way his smile impacted you know his presence and the thing about a smile is you're supposed to be confident in it it's supposed to be that thing that everyone sees it's literally the first thing that people see um, when you're laughing or when you're having a good time, they see your smile. And something with me that a lot of people don't know is I actually, I suck my thumb uh, from since I was a baby, probably up until I was almost 12 years old. It actually caused me to have very buck teeth and uh, there was a big space in between two, but uh, I got a bonding when I was in high school instead of getting the braces and I thought that would fix it. Uh, I never really told anyone that, so. so when we looked at Bo, you know, Bo's a big guy. He's like seven feet tall and he's, you know, his teeth didn't really fit him. His teeth didn't feel proportional to the rest of his smile. Everything was really narrow and constricted and his teeth just didn't really fit him. So, so we sat down and we started looking at, well, what can we do for Bo? And did we need to do something more extensive or could we just simply do something like a porous veneer to help him enhance the, you know, the smile and make the teeth more proportional? Make them fit him. And I know that Invisalign is a choice or getting braces, but I'm 26 years old, going to be 27. I don't want to be walking around with braces for a year. And so I heard about veneers, and um, luckily I was able to talk to Dr. Creaseman, and he sort of opened my whole view on what veneers can actually do. He told me that they can close these gaps all right here, they can make my teeth even. I have giant canines right here, and these teeth are, I mean, you guys can see it. So I'm really excited to meet with Dr. Creaseman and sort of go over everything with him and go through this whole consultation so he can sort of tell me what this whole process is like. It seems pretty straightforward and easy, but he, it just shows that Atlanta Dental Spa is so good at what they do that that's why it's easy. So Bo has a consultation with me later this afternoon and he's gonna come in and we're gonna sit down and we're gonna talk a little bit about how we can get him from a, a situation where he's not really comfortable in his smile to where he can just smile with confidence and not think about having to guard himself or be self-conscious in, in the way he looks. I guess all I'm trying to say is I'm tired of missing moments because I'm worrying about my smile. I want to be able to live my life and have a smile just be a part of me. I, I don't want it to be a secondary thought. I just want it to be a fact about me, a, a, something that I'm living with every single day that I don't think once about. I want to live in a moment and not think twice about anything. I want to smile. I just want to smile. I know it sounds dumb, but I, I just want to smile.